Thank you so much for watching. Today I'm gonna do a small update on the garden tower. It's not looking as good as I'd hoped for this time of the year. A lot of things have died out. The squash has gotten pruned except for one plant and many of the herbs are also not growing as expected. The plants have a lot of yellowing throughout and I suspect that there is a nutritional issue here and also a water issue, both caused by me since I am the caretaker of this garden tower. Pretty soon I'll be removing the tomatoes in replacement for a fall crop. The tomatoes did pretty well for most of the summer, then towards August they started to decline. Many of the micro tomatoes I planted in this tower did okay, but they all kind of fell prey to the extreme heat of the summer and then my inability to keep them consistently watered. I also planted a pink blooming dandelion which has not bloomed or even gotten close to blooming in this bed. My herbs seem to be doing much better than the tomatoes. I've been able to harvest quite a bit from them. They do show signs of stress with yellowing leaves and several of them have began blooming I've been doing really good at harvesting and drying and harvesting and drying all season long. My herb stockpile is grown so much and that I am so thankful for. This is a pineapple ground cherry plant. I grew ground cherries two years ago and was not going to grow any this year but decided to try a different variety. The variety I grew before was Aunt Molly's and this is pineapple. I do taste a difference but still they're not really my cup of tea. I'll see you in the next video.